Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss on the lessons from Reminiscences of Stock Operator by Edwin Lefebvre. Reminiscences of a Stock Operator is a timeless text that imparts valuable insights into the world of stock trading and speculation. Written in a conversational and insightful style, it offers a plethora of wisdom drawn from the experiences of a successful trader. The narrative underscores the enduring principles that guide successful speculation and highlights common pitfalls to avoid. One of the key takeaways is the notion that market patterns and human behavior tend to repeat themselves. The idea that whatever happens today in the market has happened before and will happen again serves as a reminder that history often rhymes in the world of finance. This suggests that traders should learn from past events and patterns to make informed decisions. The text emphasizes the importance of decisiveness in trading, whether trading a single lot or 10 lots courage isn't a distinguishing factor. The ability to act swiftly when opportunities arise is critical. The mantra that your business with the market is right now underscores the need for immediate action. Furthermore, the narrative underscores the solitary nature of trading. It asserts that trading is primarily a one-person endeavor, and there's no need to share one's business or strategies with others. This emphasizes the importance of self-reliance and the need to develop one's judgment and instincts. Risk management is another pivotal theme. The text suggests that traders should always prioritize risk control. Trading legend Paul Tudor Jones, for instance, focuses more on avoiding losses than seeking profits. Stop-loss orders, both in terms of price and time, are advocated as essential tools for preserving capital. The importance of discipline and patience is repeatedly stressed. Trading shouldn't be driven by the desire for constant action. The narrative discourages the impulse to trade daily for the sake of it and cautions against overtrading, which can lead to losses. The text also provides insights into the dynamics of market sentiment and discusses how excessive bullishness can lead to market manipulation by insiders to shake out overconfident traders. This highlights the significance of understanding market psychology and avoiding herd mentality. Richard Dennis's successful experiment with the turtle trader serves as an example of how trading skills can be taught and cultivated. The story illustrates that trading can be approached as a skill to be honed through education and discipline. Additionally, the text emphasizes the need for self-belief and independent thinking in trading, relying on tips, or following the crowd is discouraged, and traders are encouraged to trust their own judgment. The narrative suggests that nobody can provide better tips than one's own judgment and experience. The concept of reading the market is discussed, emphasizing the need to determine when to buy or sell based on underlying conditions and probabilities. It advises traders to be mindful of their emotions, particularly fear and hope, which can lead to poor decision making. Lastly, the text advocates the importance of learning from both victories and defeats. While profits are desirable, losses can be valuable lessons. It encourages traders to be adaptable and open to changing market conditions. In summary, Reminiscences of a Stock Operator offers a wealth of wisdom for traders and speculators and emphasizes the importance of historical patterns, immediate action, risk control, discipline, self-reliance, and understanding market psychology. It serves as a timeless guide for those seeking success in the world of trading and speculation. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like this video.